YouTube, WG Revival, back with another Tremaine piece. Let's have a look. Three ingredients, a 80ml MDF base, a resin well from that Fenris Games, and some dash modelling clay. So what I'm going to do is, I've put some pins in there just to sort of hold it in place a bit more securely when I just squish it into the dash. But I'm going to sort of build it up a little around there and put a bowl in the middle just to try and give an illusion of depth. And the MDF base, I could have probably used a beer mat, but that cost me about 80p plus postage from a well known auction site. Beer mats are theoretically free, but I would have spent about £30 on beer and possibly food and so on. And they might not have been round, so I'd have had to go back again and again and again. It would have cost me an absolute flipping fortune. This way, I've got something. I'm still sober. I haven't spent a fortune on booze, and I know it's the right shape. There didn't seem a lot of point doing a step by step for the build. All I've done is build it up on the outside with das, put a bowl on the inside also with das, and. I haven't come mad on the texturing on the inside because uh, it's going to be very dark colours, it won't even show up. And that's really it, that's all there is to the build. It's not much of a build project really. I think the interest for me is in the painting, so I want very mossy on the inside, possibly slightly mossy on the outside. But it's that moss effect, I think, is the, the fun bit for me. And skip to the end. I hadn't thought of putting water effects in, which is a strange one for a uh, well, famously uh, watery terrain pieces. But I'm glad I did. A, it looks much, much better with it, and B, um, I've sort of conquered my fear of water effects. Uh, last time I saw them on the channel, they were a bit bubbly, I was a bit cross, and, and so on. Uh, these look a lot, a lot, lot better. Uh, still not completely bug free, but uh, you've got to look a lot more carefully for them. I'm quite chuffed with it overall. Uh, so I've got a couple of shades of green in here for it all to be mossy. I'm not sure how well that uh, shows up in the light that we have here. If I'm being super critical, which I always am, I've built that up a bit too much. It's quite a tall well. Here are a couple of Perry Knights who are kind of dwarfed by it a little. Less so this uh, Space Marine, but still you can just about see over it. So it's kind of massive, but I don't know, it's a terrain piece, it's got water in it, you make allowances. I make allowances anyway. I'm quite chuffed with that. I'll be back before too long with some actual figures. I know the terrain has been uh, featuring fairly, well, in, in as much as anything has been featuring heavily on this channel lately, terrain has. But uh, yeah, there's, there's figures on the way as well. There's Malifaux crew, there's a bit of Frost Grey stuff. Uh, there's uh, another another game system, of course, there's another game system, you know me, um, but we'll uh, cross that bridge when we come to it. But for now, there's a terrain piece, there's some success with water effects. Thanks for watching, I'll speak to you soon.